We did challenging on every other one. They have sown the wind and they shall reap the whirlwind. Can you imagine it? I'm a oh crap. Um, I'm sorry. Hold on one second. It's not now. Accessibility. I don't think this is it. Subtitles. Holy crap. How can we forget that? Dyslexia? What the hell is that? What? Uh, yeah, let's show the speaker's name. Oh, no, wait, that might ruin... No, we won't do that. That might ruin s surprises. Okay. Tempting to. I bet you can see for a hundred miles at the top. We should make that our first Hey, the World's Fair. Do they still do that? Whatever pleases you the most. You please me the most. You mean you are not weary of me after an entire day of marriage? I will never be weary of you. I shall hold you to that, my dear. <laughs> he looks like the guy from the last game. Just a right. little bit. Isn't this grand? Advertised. QTEs. Very nice. Let's check in. It's gonna pop up from behind the desk and scare him. Are we the only ones here? I'm sure there was a mad dash first thing this morning to get to the fair. again oh well that's not good well this does not bode well for the level of service we're in store for um, yeah we're excited let's not wait till tomorrow morning Let's sign in and go straight there. We're not going anywhere if no one checks us in. Slow service. That means they're making sure everything is perfect. Yeah, we'll That's go with that. Marie. Always finding that silver lining. My sincere oh. apologies. For both startling you and for making you wait. My attention was needed elsewhere. elsewhere. I promise from here on out it will be nothing but silver linings. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Please, sign in here. Oh, I wonder if we're going to get to explore, First time like, in Chicago, I'm going to hazard a guess and assume you're the entire here to World's the Fair. Exposition. The fair, yes, but that's not all. Today is a very special day for us. Oh, the honeymoon. How very, very lovely. He doesn't seem very happy about this. <clears throat> Perhaps my wife, Mrs. Whitman, would like to sign. Yes, today's the beginning of our honeymoon. Congratulations. 
in that case, an upgrade is in order. A honeymoon right. suite it is. Oh, well, uh, are the rates that much higher? <laughs> I think nothing of it. The same rates as your regular room. The upgrade is on us. You're our first honeymooners. How kind. Thank you, Mr. Holmes. Henry Howard Holmes. You I'm have a lovely hotel, sure Mr. Holmes. Holmes. Well, thank you very much. I designed and built most of it myself. You're an architect, then? Architect, designer, builder, doctor, artist. I'm a man of many interests. I see. Impressive. Please, have a look around. We have sundries and gifts at the pharmacy counter. I'll take your luggage up to your room and ensure that everything is in order. Just make a note if you decide to purchase anything, and we will add it to your bill. How's well, that how that works? Thank you, Mr. Holmes. We appreciate it. The pleasure is all mine. You seem very upset about all this. What did I forget to bring? What's this? Bar of soap? What is it? Oh. Oh. Pardon me, miss. Careful, you. My husband gets awfully cross with men who act fresh. Hmm. <laughs> He sounds like a ripe fellow. How's the marriage going? Lovely. Thanks for asking. Well, let's just head up. I'm sure the room is ready. See oh, I anything forgot. good over there at the jewelry counter? Anything fancy? Wouldn't you like to know? I wonder what's in here. Rollin? I'm starting to think I've gone and married a thrill seeker. Ferris wheels, forbidden rooms. Are we looking for excitement? Perhaps. <sighs> what? Nothing but an unfinished room. See what happens when you chase a thrill? If this is you trying to get out of the Ferris wheel. I know you won't be denied. Why? Why would you just want to go in here? What's that? Oh, God. <gasps> Don't move. Ah, oh, crap. Already? I was afraid just to guy. Why'd you go in here in the first place? makes no sense there was no point of coming in here what if somebody was what if somebody was naked in here why is somebody shutting the door <laughs> that was a thrill you won't think it's thrilling if we're sleeping on the street after getting kicked out of here Close the door. Now he knows something's up. He, he, like he just watched you walk out of that room. Welcome, newlyweds, to the honeymoon suite. 
Thank you kindly, Mr. Holmes. Do enjoy your stay. If you'll excuse me, I have work to return to. I'm sure we'll see each other again soon. <laughs> Goodness, this place is fit for a king. Or my queen. Oh, you. Kiss this. That is not very wifely of you. Hey! Ah, bullseye! You asked for it. Him in the face. <laughs> Should I be frightened? If you're smart. Yeah. Mercy, mercy. Okay, you win. Special Anything feature broken? unlocked. Only my pride. How about a peace offering? Hmm. This feels like some sort of treacherous plot. Not at all. I have a gift for you. Close your eyes. Face the mirror. Aren't you clever and romantic? If I get a pillow to the face, I will sock you right in the kisser. <laughs> Is there a problem? No. Open your eyes. Oh, Jeff, it's lovely. I love it. Good. Victory is mine. I'll let you have that bath now. Oh. Well, that's not good. Oh, is he in the bath? What do you do? Well, it's clearly locked. It's jammed shut. Maybe if we put a little weight into it? <sighs> Open sesame! <laughs> Thank you. Why don't you have a shave while I take a quick bath? Then we can reconvene. I know that word. It's French for something illicit. <laughs> Shush. Shave. I think I forgot to pack my razor and kit. I'm sure the pharmacy downstairs has them. Don't be too long in that bath. Don't you worry. Oh, she's gonna die here. Okay, eight, oh, 1893, all right. Find a shaving kit. Oh yeah, silly me, how could I forget? How could I forget? <laughs> Prologue. Oh. Um. Do I have to? Hmm. I could have sworn this was the way we came up. Oh. What's going on here? Elevator. It's way forward. Did I check that door? He's probably just gonna make. Yeah, let's check the door quick. He'll probably just make a comment about it.
All right. So this is the way they came up. There's a door here now. This on the other side of the said door. What? That's up on the screen. Oh, we can equip items now? Interesting. What did I pick? Did, did I just powder my nose? The fuck's that? Did you see that guy? See him in the mirror. Hmm. That's a hot ass bat. Look at all that steam. Is that you, darling? Jeff? Mm. Oh, are we playing another game? Uh, let's investigate. <laughs> Bearing updated. Okay, Mr. Sneaky. You can't sneak up on me, Mr. <gasps> Ooh. Holmes. Hello, my what are dear. you doing in here? Jeff! I don't think he can quite hear you. <laughs> oh, oh, wait. Get away from me! But I'm not finished yet. I said get Wait. Do I have like a graphic turn? Don't fight it. Will only hurt more if you do. Yourself, sir. I've seen your wife has had an accident. Oh, she did. Is there a problem, sir? Oh, she's like right there. <laughs> our prologue oh is that the wedding ring this place for it is everything in its place well look at this oh it's 
Wonderful. Only the best for you, my dear. Mother would simply die. It's so I say, popular. good man, do you work here? Hello. Welcome to the World's Fair Hotel. Murder oh. Castle. We're in a hurry. Oh. Why are you acting? Oh. You're here. Have you been waiting long? Welcome back. I do enjoy seeing a familiar face. Last time, no one survived. I wonder if you were even trying. It's so good to have company. Wait, no one survived? For a long time, I was on my own. I can barely recall a time oh, when I was bad ending last time, didn't watching we? over these tales. And what good are stories without somebody to experience them? This is a story about those who create and the lengths they might go to for their art to be made pure. Art can elicit all sorts of reactions, delight, Inspiration, desire, yes, but also doubt, fear, dread. The way you react, the decisions you make, would affect this story. Hidden in the world, you'll find dark pictures. They give glimpses of the possible consequences of your choices. And sometimes it's the smallest choices that can have the biggest repercussions. You're responsible for what happens. You're culpable. I can't interfere. That's very much against the rules. I can only observe what happens and record any significant events. Oh. Ever seen one of these? They're very old. People used to call them obbles. They'd put them in the mouth of the recently deceased to pay the ferryman. Look out for them. You'll find them in the strangest of places. Okay. I'll be happy to exchange any that you find, and I'll certainly make it worth your while. Okay. So this is... Well, shall we start? The game a lot is a different. I will be watching. Than the last three. 
my name is Kate Wilder. I've got a master's in criminal psychology. I'm an investigative journalist and hope to make a difference. You may have recently seen my interview on Chicago AM on... And, uh, and yeah, it's really tough when just being honest means everyone thinks you're a bitch. I'm not sure I've got issues to deal with, same as everyone. I I'm working on it. I... Hey, I'm Mark. I study photography at UCLA. Um, at a great time. Really want to get back to some serious photography. But yeah, it's a, it's a job. I've done a key grip and lighting test for years. See a problem? Light it. You don't often meet someone like that. Man, how do you even start? I'm sick of being on my own. Sorry, do you start with qualifications or, um, like personal info? Because I don't, I mean, will anyone access this? I'm kind of private, actually. Uh, yeah, Charlie Lonitz, UK originally. I've uh, been here for 20 years. The last series was so on track, it was, uh, it was a very beautifully conceived and, um, didn't quite, uh, uh hit the mark as I was hoping it would. It's a fucking mess, to be honest with you. I think we've heard quite enough. Enough? <laughs> oh, I've barely begun, Your Honor. You don't seem to understand. I was born with the devil in me. I could not help the fact that I was a murderer any more than a poet can help the inspiration to sing. Oh. Bury me deep, Your Honor. Make sure they fill my pine box with cement. Put me deeper than anyone else. And cover the ground with more cement. Cause trust me. Just being dead ain't enough to stop me from killing again. On May 7th, 1896, Herman Mudgett, a.k.a. Henry H. Holmes, was sent to the gallows. <coughs> oh. His neck did not snap from the force of hanging. Records indicate he hung, slowly suffocating for over 15 minutes, until finally the this monster really was weird. dead. America's first serial killer confessed to 27 murders, but his investigators sifted through the traces he left behind, following his path from city to city. The number grew significantly. Nearly 200 lives. Yeah, man was America's busy. first serial killer and possibly the worst. He was buried as requested under concrete. Was he hoping to hide from God's judgment? Or did he truly want to keep the devil from climbing out and killing again? So, what do you think? Nobody. To be honest, Charlie, this is a pilot. Hold that thought. Lonnet Entertainment. Charles Lonnet, please. Speaking, Charlie is fine. My name is Grantham Dumet. What can I do for you, Mr. Dumet? Actually, it's what I can do for you. Hear me out. I'm certainly grateful to you, Mr. <clears throat> Dumet. This all sounds amazing, but I, uh... I just, I'm waiting to hear what the catch is. No offense. None taken. I'm in a privileged position. I don't need for much. But my time is at a premium. We need to do this today. I'll send a car for you this afternoon, 4 p.m. Be ready. This afternoon? We're talking a couple of days shoot. I told my team they're free this weekend, and frankly, they're a temperamental bunch. Without them, this conversation is dead in the water. We, uh... I've told you what I have. Please don't waste my time. Am I sending the car or not? Yes. Of course. We're in. I'll get them there. I promise. Let's do it. They do not seem very happy about this. Ooh, we're getting a limousine. 
Mr. Dumet send you? We... Right. Let's load up, guys. All right, got it. I'm good. <clears throat> Sorry. Are you? I mean, this is that ring light that makes you all glowy. We leave it behind I know, it. you're right. This is going to be grand, people. Adventure. <laughs> Excitement. Anyone? Road trip. Huzzah. Woohoo. Hooray. This is going to be great, guys. Hey, Shangy and Spider Hop, what's going on? Crazy. Welcome in. You know what this just reminds me of? Don't say. Did How you doing come? tonight? Exactly. Me, no money in my pocket, a dead phone, and lost in the middle of goddamn Topeka. That wasn't my fault. It was 100% your fault, because you fly by the seat of your ass. So, come on, Charlie. What do we know about this guy? He's rich, he's a recluse, he's obsessed with H.H. H. Holmes. Totally sane, I'm sure. We're going to a property he inherited from a relative. That's who had the obsession with Holmes. Doing Some good, that's good to hear. Some of the recreations from the murder castle. Dumet has blueprints, documents, artifacts. When I said this would save the show, I was not exaggerating. And you substantiated all of this? Just trust me. Man, you get big night to level 32? Heck yeah. Sorry for all the mystery. Before we go any further, I have to ask that we lock up your phones for safekeeping. While this may sound strange that I invite you to film the collection inside my home, I cannot allow any personal devices that may share information that could affect about my this? business or lifestyle. There are rules. All footage you wish to use must be authorized by me first. I require privacy and discretion. I must insist. His place, his rules. Look, what he's offering us is worth it. He could be making us pay, but he isn't. If this is all he asks, then yeah, we Yeah, you're not too far off from that end boy. For the show. I'm telling you, this is going to be great. You said that in Topeka. Yep, yeah, and none of you have cell phones now. see this going well at all if this dude is so rich shouldn't he have service or something is this guy gonna help <clears throat> no really I got it thanks oh, bro don't sweat it jackass Okay, so now what? I'd love to get some footage of the lake and the scope of this. Not with all the mist and fog. There, from on high we'll get a better look. That's certainly, um, up there. The, the visuals will be great and we can frame up over the mist. Charlie, you'll hack up a lung before you're halfway up there. I'm fit as a butcher's dog. Mark, this is crazy. We'll be fine. Let's go, Charlie. Be careful, guys. Nice knowing you. Not the setting I was expecting. Oh. All right, well, we're over here. Let's uh, make sure we get a good look around. We don't want to miss anything of importance. Be some of those uh, pictures lying around. Tell our fortune. Let's see what's in here. Oh, we can't get in there. All right. Well, maybe there isn't anything over here. I have an odd boat dog. This is taking too long. Well, I'm sorry. I'm looking around for stuff. I mean, let's not ignore. What's this? Can I look at this? Ah, whatever. 
the uh this kind of reminds me of the uh scene from Resident Evil Revelations 2 when you first get to the island with Barry it's got that same kind of feel to it get going so how are you guys supposed to get all your stuff up here hey guys hurry up we're on it just need to jog along I guess Jesus, that is loud. Man, it's meant to be heard from miles away. Well, yeah, I know that in theory, but... Oh, so much for plan A. Well, I mean, let's uh, hope nothing back. happens. You guys are kind of stuck Come here on. now. Anything for this shot, closer subject right? to erosion and may collapse into deep water without Doesn't warning. Hey, serious. that is good to know. Warning about everything falling into the ocean. I'm gonna say we trust and not die. Nah, this sign is something the lawyers made them put up. I'm sure it's fine. Hard disagree. Jump down and access new areas? How open is it? Just how open this is. Listen, Mark, I just wanted to say... Just give me um, the option to... Thanks for backing me up, man. Okay, what? I can climb over right there, I'm but... Getting so quick. let's, uh... No, for the whole trip. You know some of the crew oh. can be challenging. To work with. This. Jamie and Kate would never have agreed to come if you hadn't been on board. I figured that the episode was such a mess. We need to go back together. to the same right. way. Yeah. Thought maybe I going we around did. we'd find something. You guys aren't even bringing anything with you. You're gonna try some Pokemon monologues? Right on. Let me know how that goes. It's okay, here. I won't lie. I was hoping being here all remote and away from the world that maybe I'd have some downtime, some space to decompress. Downtime? Why would you want to do that? You know, relax a bit. I've never seen the attraction. Must have been quite Cassiopeia. a storm. Hmm, that name sure sounds familiar. Crashing the rocks at the base of these cliffs. It's almost like we were playing another game with somebody named Cassiopeia in it. Oh, we got this. Look at this. It's ridiculous. Get on with it. Look at all this walking we're doing just to get to the freaking top. Rap, I'd like to take a couple weeks off, go see my family. I need you in post. I really appreciate that discerning eye of yours, you know. I got a lot going on at the moment, Charlie. Oh, right, yeah, of course, sure. Take a couple of weeks. Get your head together. I appreciate it. I'll be fine in post, Mama. You should do the same. Take some time out. You got any family you can go and bother? Oh, well... No, Mrs. Bonnet, you got hiding in some closet somewhere? Married to the job. Married to the job. <laughs> but, uh, is this the How's place we need to go to? Out? Well, from what I hear about real marriages, pretty damn good. Oh, jeez, not this. Married to the job. Not balancing. Uh, 
Oh no. Oh no. I hate that in games. Oh, Pokey Rogue. Ooh, I didn't see that. Yeah, Pokey Rogue's a rough game. Yeah, it's your hair. Hmm. I want to give that game a try one of these days. What are you looking at? Just looking. I've gotten used to playing games where the character's head will kind of rotate the uh, things of interest. What's going to pop out? Oh, Jesus. Christ, what the hell is that? A mannequin. You know, just hanging out. Maybe it's part of some old museum display or something. Right. That's probably it. <laughs> Stupid thing actually made me jump. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh. Why is there a lamp up here? Why are we going all the way up here? <laughs> the house we're filming at you coming yeah just looking at the light on the mist how is that gonna fit into the show see this it just caught my eye coming always the photographer i can't exactly turn it off there's a lot of crossover between the creative stuff and the okay well here's my stuff. problem mm -hmm. i don't know you sure about that because crossover with kate hasn't exactly we agree to let that drop just making sure your head's in the game. Alright, this is locked. I can probably squeeze through that fence right there. Locked tight. Come on. There must be another way. You sure? No. I'm optimistic. Hey, fire loss gra- oh, oh, never mind. Fire loss gravity, you don't get a freaking shout. Get the hell out of here with your damn cheap viewers. I don't need none of that shit. Okay, so I I can shimmy. Let's see what's over here. This is just a small side building. here this thing hasn't been manned in ages why's the horn still gone because they didn't decommission the fog it's all automatic now what year are we in currently in this game 2000s right now well this last time it was updated was in the 2000s in game i don't know what year we're currently in Read, please. Last night's foghorn test was successful. It looks like the automation is all up and running. One final try out a day and pack away the kit. Poor homeless guy hanging around again. Cool. Alright, so is that everything in here? I believe so. Just those two items. Alright, that is locked. I guess back out the way we came in. Alright, now we can head to our main point of interest. Doing, buddy? Why are you just staring at this building? I'm super curious what year it is right now in game. I guess we'll find out. If it didn't say already and I 
you know, just wasn't paying attention. Which, uh, oh, you got to crawl too? Swear to God, I don't like the way this camera's panning. What's going to jump out at me? One of you pushing and the other one pulling? Is that what happened? Okay, look around. You need to keep an eye out for some of those. Oh, what's this? This looks pretty old. Interesting. It's tie clipped open lunch boxes. Oh, hey, it's one of those things. What's that? Just some old coin. Can you be used to unlock dioramas? Yeah. Okay. Look, sorry I give you a hard time now and again, but. I really couldn't make these shows without you. That's so I true. do know. I may be driving this car. What car? The Lonnet Entertainment car. But you're the one who keeps the engine going. That's not how cars work. Jesus, you try and give someone a compliment. Thanks, Charlie. I get it. We gotta push it from here. Guessing this is what we have to do. I mean, they put a lot of stuff into this. Locked. Yeah, I want to find some of those uh, pictures that tell our fortune. A little breaking and entering. How are you not in jail? <laughs> well, I don't like this very much at all. Christ, what the hell is that? the hell's that? Nice to meet you too. What was it? Just need some fresh sheets, some nice drapes, and six gallons of sanitizer. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay. Can't go through those doors. I guess we're going upstairs. feel about that height mechanic. Charlie, I feel like it's gonna get I'm me getting killed. an uneasy feeling about this. Somebody has a taxidermy hobby. Relax. <laughs> Some hobby. Oh, yeah. I'm not liking this at all. Why is there... Why is there a plate and a bottle on top? Somebody was here recently. 
What in God's name is this? Well, it looks like it. Ah! It moved. What? The thing. It moved. Why? Why? Why am I <laughs> getting fucking jump scared by this lame shit? I can tell I haven't played a horror game in a while. What's this? That's all it's in here? Oh. Okay, I guess we're going up. It's gonna be okay. It's all gonna be okay. Look at this. It's perfect. Come on. Get shooting. I want you to pan across the lake until the island comes into shot. Then zoom into that lighthouse. What, what are you going to see at that lighthouse? Look, there's our ride. Come on. We better get back. <laughs> 